friends, welcome to the vlog. We are packing and prepping the next two days. But obviously we gotta start here. It's just the little joys. I used to be very anti lights on during the day, like any lights, even if it was dark in there, I was like, I'd rather the natural light. But as of late, with just so much darkness and lack of sunshine, I feel like I have to bring the cozy vibes back. Otherwise it's just like getting a little sad in here. That's one, and we're doing the lamp. And it somewhat feels like nighttime now, like it's like evening vibes, but I need it. <laughs> I mean, really, I just need a quick sunshine break. Like a little getaway, which is what we're doing. I leave in two days for Mexico. I'm so excited for like a little girl's trip, some time in the sun, some reading time. Anyone in Ontario right now, I think we all get it. The sun has not been coming through. And this is like, it's gonna fuel my soul again. I was honestly also really curious to see how much winter I could theoretically handle. Like at what point in the winter, when the sun is gone forever, do I start to disintegrate now? It's now. Disintegrate isn't quite the word, but you know what I'm saying. So we have to prep. Now prepping includes, you know, seeing friends, meeting friends, new kitten. I want to self tan for the first time in forever. I want to whiten the teeth again, just looking fresh. I got to paint my toenails because they're looking real bad. I want to clean the house. Got to pick my outfits and pack them. I also got to get some work done because I am going away for five days. I am not someone that likes skipping an upload day. So we have to get on that. Starting off with the first vlog to edit. I've gotten ready ever. Makeup took literally three minutes, maybe three and a half. Still a win, still a win. I gotta call my Uber. You know when the shower is just so nice and warm and you just don't wanna get out? I always play music in the shower and so I'm just jamming out in the warm water. It's so nice. But then I inevitably end up running a little late. But I'm only one minute behind, one minute. I'll get there at 12.31, that's fine. Okay, socks, shoes, jacket, one minute away. Okay, I'm gonna be perfectly on time, look at that. <laughs> they look good, like whatever that is. Um, <laughs> See, maybe another time. Got my classic avocado and cream cheese rolls. Wow. Okay, I'm so excited. I can't wait to see what, like, how little she is. It's like a little baby. I'm actually so unwell. I feel like I want to cry. Oh my gosh. Are we not? <laughs> Oh my gosh, she is bigger. Oh, a little. Stop it. Oh, no. oh my. Okay, wait, no, it. she's not real. What? Sorry. <laughs> what was that? Sorry. Oh, no way. Okay. <gasps> have... This is a present from Felipe. Oh, 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 he's making. Oh, oh no oh, way. Oh, are you oh, real? <gasps> so cute. Koji. Okay, two things to take note of. First of all, it is 5.15, it is still light outside. I feel like it happened overnight where suddenly it's not dark at 4.30. Second thing, that kitten melted my heart. I stared at her for the last three hours and it was the greatest three hours of my life. She was so cute. If I wasn't allergic to cats, it would be an easier decision for me to get one. Honestly, after seeing the little kitten, it would be perfect, but I am allergic and I was sneezing up a storm and the eyes are itchy. So that's that, but such a lovely day. So good to see them. Glad I got to see them before I'm gone for like a week. Not that that's that long, but glad to see them. I'm gonna have a snack. Okay, my snack has been eaten and now I gotta get back to work. Can't believe it's 520, Jesus. I think tomorrow's gonna be like the prep, like the tanning, the white, well, maybe I'll whiten tonight. We'll see, but I gotta grind for the rest of the day here. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna dive in and we'll see when I pop back up. Uh, 45 seconds. 
and we're only popping back the following day at 1.45. I've just been power working, trying to get ahead so I can go away and not have to really think about work. I haven't totally decided if I'm gonna vlog yet. I'm not sure, but I am sure that I need something sweet. This is my way of self-motivating when it is gloomy as fuck. Decided that I am desperate for sunshine at this point. I need it. The white fluffy is amazing, but it just makes me want to sit by the fireplace and read my book and like, I can't do that. Regardless, I have gotten my work done or at least to this point and I'm having a little Trader Joe's boba. So if the next vlog is not a Mexico vlog, I will be vlogging on TikTok. I also would like to say after all the responses on my last vlog, two vlogs ago, by the time you see this, it is so crazy that like literally everyone hates shorts, myself included. I've never watched a single one and I don't actually think I will ever watch anyone's shorts because I just, that's where I go to TikTok. It is interesting that YouTube, a platform, this is so side note, but if you missed that vlog, I'll link it down below with my thoughts. That YouTube, a platform that's always been long form content is trying so hard to mesh into this like short form world when it's just not necessary. Like that's truly how I think of it. And I really don't think I will ever, ever stop with long form content. So no worries there. I saw so many people being like, please don't stop. I have no intentions of stopping with my regular vlogs, but I probably will try to throw some shorts in there for people that do like shorts and for the reachability. I don't know. I don't know what's going on, but I have boba and <laughs> mm, this is what I needed. A little sugar. Okay, it is time for some self tan. I have not self tanned in like at least a year. Normally I do this naked, but because we're vlogging, you know, that's just not gonna work. I have a couple different options. I could use this like water one or this mousse that I know is, I'm gonna go for the reliable one. Not the time to try something new. I was also just looking at the weather and it looks like it's gonna rain for the first two days there. So this is gonna be extra beneficial. I'm also gonna do my face. I'm gonna try to like contour with it. I've done this before. I've seen so many people do this. Ooh, do you see how green that is? Maybe I should shake it. It's fine. That is so green. See, I like that so there's like literally no orange undertone. I'm also using an ultra dark. I'm also not taking off my jewelry, which I know is a big no-no, but I literally cannot take off my necklaces. <laughs> my nails are just too thick. Okay, I'm really gonna try to do a decent job here so I don't walk around with self tan lines. But if by some chance I end up with the lines, it's fine. I don't really care that much. Okay, let's try to do my chest. Okay, honestly, loving this already. I am loving this. I need to do this more in the winter time because a tan just makes you feel so good. Whenever I have a tan, my confidence just goes up. This was a good idea. And then while this develops, I'm gonna put on some whitening strips for my teeth. The back is always questionable. I can't even believe I'm gonna be in Mexico tomorrow. I can't even believe it. I'm so excited. I like a little girl strip. I don't think it's so bad. And now for the fun part, the face. Okay, I'm gonna use this little brush to blend in the tanner where I want it on my face. I'm a little nervous but it's gonna be fine. Oh. And now we blend. I haven't done this in forever. Ooh, shit. But whenever I see a TikTok of anyone doing this, they definitely look a little, a little nuts, but then you wash it off and it's not so bad. Maybe I should've done the dark instead of ultra dark. It's fine. Snatch out the jawline. <laughs> Over break. Oh my God. Oh, it's gonna be crazy. Okay, the forehead. Dare I try the nose? I'm gonna do it. Well, you know, in person looking in the mirror, I don't think it looks as crazy as it maybe does on camera. Or maybe that's in my head. Either way, I'm gonna do the rest of my body, I'm gonna do my legs, and then we'll do the teeth whitening. <laughs> Just curly things. <laughs> okay, I'm feeling bronzed. I did the rest of my body, and I'm gonna brush my teeth, and then do my teeth whitening. I have to keep the tan on for six hours, and then this is like 30 minutes, yeah. So while this sits on my teeth, I'm gonna clean the house. I'm also gonna pluck my eyebrows. Maybe a little something. I have to say, looking in the mirror, the face tan looks good. It looks good. So if it looks questionable to you, I promise. Well, I can't super promise, but I mostly promise. I think it's gonna be okay. Also, yes, I do have a developing tan on and I'm wearing a white robe. And I know those things do not go hand in hand, but it's really all I'm working with. It's fine. You know, I kind of love this stuff. Like I love having something to do all this stuff for. It just makes me so excited. Cute. And then the bottom. Learn this hack from TikTok. You stretch the strip and then it covers more teeth. And then all the gel comes out. Like it's, apparently this is how you're supposed to do it.
four o'clock now. I don't know what is happening to the day. It's stressing me out, honestly. I've been cleaning, putting things away, doing the computer stuff that has to get done. Look outside. Almost all of this is from today. Like, can you see what's happening? It's really coming down. If you can see, winter wonderland. It looks so pretty. Like, I just want to step in it. <laughs> I really want to start packing, but I feel like I have to wait until my tan is done and, like, I wash it off. Because it's kind of hard to, like, want to pack things when your sleeves are huge and just, like... Feel like a big blob. I still have a few hours until I want to wash this off. So in the meantime, I'm gonna paint my toenails, get that done. I've checked on the tan, it doesn't look splotchy. My face looks crazy. My nose especially, oh my god. But I feel like we're gonna come together here. And I have some time tomorrow morning. The flight's at one, so I'm not overly stressed. And the house is like 90% clean. I just gotta turn on my dishwasher, take out my trash and some boxes to the recycling, which I'll do probably tonight or maybe tomorrow morning. Overall, not feeling so bad. I feel like I've gotten better at prepping for trips so I don't panic the day of because I've done that many times, too many times. And then I get like super stressed about it. I feel relaxed. I feel good. I also decided I will vlog some of the trips, so that'll be the next vlog. Holy shit. I also gotta make sure I finish editing this vlog. Maybe I'll do that once I'm done with my toes. I'm not gonna go there with any expectation of having high-speed Wi-Fi, so this has gotta be uploaded before we go tomorrow. Okay. Editing. Okay, it is 6 p.m. I've decided I'm going to start packing. I'm not gonna try anything on because obviously I have the tan on and I just, I don't really feel like it. Plus a lot of this I've already tried on because I tried it on for TikTok. So I got a whole bunch of stuff from Revolve that I'm gonna bring. I have this long cover up and that's really cute. I also have this one. This one I liked a little less. I will link the TikTok down below. It's a nice dress. I love the color, but I don't know. I wasn't like obsessed. I also have this, which is great just like to walk down to the pool and feel like a little vibe. Just like throw this on top of my bikini. I'm definitely gonna overpack, like for sure. I don't know what we're doing every day. We're kind of going with the flow. There's like beach clubs and there's nightclubs and that is not my norm. So I don't really know what to do. So I'm gonna bring a lot of stuff. Honestly, most of my life I've avoided clubs and that world like just I don't know, it's just never been my thing. But I do worry that one day I'll look back at my youth and regret not going to beach clubs and dancing and having fun. So I'm gonna go and I'm gonna live it up so that my older self isn't mad at me. Anyways, I have this bikini that I'm so excited to wear. I love this color. The top is perfect for tanning, so it's like this, but then it has like a little one shoulder moment. Love that bikini. I also have this two piece set, although, I don't know. So it's just like a little maxi skirt with a slit. I like the color. I felt like it just looked kind of bulky on me. So I'll try that one on again and see how I feel. This dress is perfect. It's perfect. It is so Tulum vibes. Oh my God, I can't believe I'm going to Tulum. Yeah, so this one's definitely coming. And then I have this dress. It's supposed to be attached, but I detached it because I couldn't figure out how to put it on. This is like a dinner kind of vibe, obviously. Then I have these two skirts. This like zebra one is kind of fun. I'm not sure. If it's super Tulum though, I don't know. And then I have this knit one. Looks like this. And then I was thinking of wearing this bathing suit top with it. Wait, this is so small. Oh my God. Okay, I I'm gonna have to try this one on. And I got this little bag that I thought was gonna be so cute. The strap has these little seashells on it. Thought this was nice. I don't really wanna bring any of my nice bags just, just to be safe. Uh, it's also pretty roomy. Like, so cute. So that's all the new stuff that I have. I'll link all the Revolve stuff down below. But what else? can I bring? Oh, I have this pink set. This is perfect. This is coming. It's like a little linen, perfect for the pool. These little shorts and then this button up. Love, love, love. Could also in theory bring this set. It's kind of thick though, which is the one thing I'm unsure of. It's like this maxi skirt with these fringes on the bottom. It's also really long or I'm just really short. It's so pretty though. Maybe I'll bring the top. I'm gonna try things on in the morning. Yes. Ooh. I didn't know I had this. This is perfect. It's a little cover up. Maybe I'll also bring this. It's like a linen strapless dress. I'm also basing all of these choices on what I saw on TikTok and Instagram. I've been doing my research, so I know what to wear. Although I don't 100% still know what to wear, but I have an idea. This could also be a good dinner going out outfit. Now for bathing suits, because I know I'm mostly going to be living in a bathing suit. I have this. This isn't a bathing suit, but I have this little, it's a called a sarong. It's like a little cover up. Okay, so for bathing suits, we have this green one, this red one, this cute blue one, I love this one, this pink one, and then this knit one piece just to have. And the new blue one from Revolve. I feel like on beach trips, I never end up wearing like half or more than half of the stuff that I bring because I'm always just in the bikini. So we'll see what actually gets worn. I'm gonna wash off my face. It's been a good four hours. So we're just gonna, the face is fine to go, I think at this point. I'm also a little nervous. Oh shit, wait, that was a bad idea. I don't think I look crazy. I'm fairly certain, but I'm worried that my arm will because of all the dripping. I think 
just don't look crazy. Okay, I really don't think it looks crazy at all. I think it looks perfect. Like the nose I was most concerned about, honestly, I was really giving Voldemort there for a sec. Just looks kind of snatched. I wanna wait the full six hours, but I think I'll shower in an hour. So I wanna have dinner and like get in my pajamas and everything, you know? Dishwasher's on, soup for dinner. I gotta finish it off. Also, I showered and so much of the tan came off. So much of it. I'm glad I did it, cause now I look like I have a bit of a base, but it's amazing how, how much comes off. I'm very hungry. Yum. I actually have quite the night ahead, so I'm gonna have my soup really fast, and then I need to edit this vlog. I think I'll finish packing in the morning, just when it's like light out, but I wanna make sure my thumbnails are done so I don't have to bring my laptop on this trip. It'll be really weird to not have my laptop, because I always bring my laptop on trips, but I'm gonna, mm, maybe I will bring it, mm, I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, I gotta eat, because I'm so hungry. So many veggies in this thing, I love it. Tomorrow morning, it's gonna be an early start to the day, but my priority is getting my videos done. It's fine if I stress tomorrow. <laughs> At least I'll have my vlogs done. That's really what matters most. I have my iPad and my laptop to work in bed, refill my water, and then I'm crawling in. Okay, this is my happy place. <laughs> Thank you for joining me on my prepping journey for this trip. I'm so excited. I cannot wait to be in the sunshine and like get some vitamin D on my skin. I am so excited. I really think that I'm gonna come back just so motivated and excited. That's at least the hope. If you wanna see what we're up to before the vlog goes live, you can follow me on Instagram or TikTok because I'll be posting there too. But until then, love you, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.